Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru. It is May 8th, 2022. I'm here for my Wordle of the Day and for Mother's Day. Blessings to all of you who are mothers, who are mothers to children who are here on this earth or otherwise, who are mothers to fur babies. Um, and I hope everyone has a blessed day. Those who have mothers or have had mothers. I had the most amazing mother on this earth, 14 of my years. She would not have put up with that behavior from that cat. I'm telling you that right now. No, she would have. Uh, she was a lot like me, huh? Funny that way. And uh, just blessings to everyone. I'm just in a good mood. Why shouldn't I be? All right, and I am going to use Mother's Day as my inspiration. And I'm going to start with the word mater. As soon as I find my fingers on my keyboard. Okay, well, that's not stellar, but we got something. And what we have, we know where it is. So I think what we should do is look for other letters that we want to put in here. R, S, T, L, N. And we've already used the E. So we need to go for our vowels. We've got O and U and I. And maybe even Y, right? So let's think of something that we can do that uses some of these. Well, My mother is on a cloud somewhere right now. I know lots of you have mothers who were amazing on this earth and are not here. Well, now we've got one more thing. We've got a C. That could be anything, but it has to be anything with the letters that are remaining. What did we... I didn't pay attention to this, did I? I just went with other things. I looked here. I saw cloud. I went with it. Okay, so uh, the vowels we have left are I or Y. <sighs> what could this be? I think I'm just going to go with all new letters. Because these are placed, so I don't have to figure out position. Um, we still have the S and the N here that we could use. What about... Oh, Firepaw. Um... Oh, and I had beautiful flowers up here. I have to enjoy as many flowers as I can on my computer because I can't actually bring them into the house. Fire plus the reason for that, too. All right, so let's see. I, I really want to, I keep looking at things that have an E in them, but I don't have that. And then I want to do canid, but I don't have the D anymore, because I really want to try an N. Hmm. Maybe canid isn't even a word. Maybe it's canis. Or maybe they're both words, and I want to find out the S. All right, let's try it. That's not a word. <sighs> okay. That's weird. I think that's a word. I have to go check. Hold on. Canid is a word. 
Kness is a word, but it's capitalized. Okay. Um, I get to indulge myself like that. It's Mother's Day. I can do things. So what about forgetting this? Because I don't need that. Let me focus on what we have here that we also might want to try. I think I want to try the S, the N, the Y. And maybe maybe a group of things like H or P. I don't know what else I want to put in there. H P B maybe. Uh, let me take a look. You know, I think I'm going to go ahead and do nymph, even though we already know the M can't be there. Or we could do hymns, because that gives us the S as well. Yes. All right, let's try that. Okay. So now we have an N here. And we have a Y either here or here. And this is the more likely spot, right? Q, W, I, P, F, G, J, K, C, X, C, but actually it could be an N, so it could be canny, V, B. Um, I think it's canny. What would it be if it were a Y here? I don't see anything. Q, W, let's do the Y. C N A nope P I'm sorry I P got a little ahead of myself there F G J K Z X V B I think it's uncanny how uncanny is not the antithesis of canny Let's try this Got it. All right, that is it for me. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. Otherwise, I hope you have an absolutely wonderful day. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.